So we're going to do a trigger point injection today, and what we're going to do is uh, use some salumedrol, and we're going to do the uh, about 40 milligrams. So what we'll do is 125 milligram bottle, two cc's, and we'll take about oh, close to 0 0.6 cc's of that. And then we're going to do bupivacaine. Uh, we're going to do a 5 cc syringe, and we'll mix it all together with bupivacaine um, and the salumedrol, and we're going to inject some trigger points. Okay, so the uh, the plugs the plugs stuck there for a minute, but we're mixing up the uh, salumedrol in two cc's of diluent. Then we're going to draw off um, 40 milligrams worth. Now 0.6 of this. One. Yeah, just go ahead and draw 0.6 of that. Good thing you're taping this. Good thing I can edit it. Yeah. About point six. Yep. All right. So uh, you've been having this neck pain going on for how long now? Uh, about a week. And so the pain that you're feeling is, is really just in this area here, and you touch here. This is where it really hurts, yes. right? Uh-huh. Okay, it's making you jump. Mm -hmm. And then, then it radiates down your arm? Yes. Okay. So we're going to clean this off real well okay. with some alcohol. Mm -hmm. so he, was, he was really hurting higher up before, and then I did some ischemic pressure where I put my fingers, thumb down, and on the muscle and hold for about three to five seconds. And um, that helped you a little bit, didn't it? Yes, sir. Sure did. So, um, so we'll, but we're still going to inject in the areas where it's improved. But we're going to do probably at least two injections, <coughs> um, and we're going to fan the needle back um, in several different directions as we deposit the steroid and the numbing medicine. Okay. A so we're going to cold spray here. We're going to do some. Uh, Painies, which is a which is a vapor coolant, and um, and then that'll that feels really cold. That mm -hmm. painies will uh, help the discomfort Big a little poke, bit. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's going to go deep in the muscle, and I usually don't aspirate because I'm moving back and forth so fast, and I just but everybody's by habit aspirates. But I'm my my process is I fan it back and forth and. But it does make sense if you're going to deposit any amount in one single location, by all means aspirate back. He's going to get immediate relief from this. Obviously your goal here is not to drop a lung, so you want to be careful not to go down to the apex of the lung. Down yeah, I would. Yeah, next, you know, go ahead and move down, and uh, spray. Go ahead and spray the, with the vapor coolant, the panties, and um, it's amazing how using the vapor coolant cuts down the amount of sensation of the needle going in. Are you getting some pain relief already, sir? Yes, sir. Yeah. Sometimes just doing a dry needle, people say, just using plain using a needle into mm. a, a muscle spasm is, is, um, helps relieve it. But we're injecting bupivacaine, 0.5%, and about a total of about 40 milligrams of salumedrol. And uh, so what would you say your pain's doing now, sir? Uh, it's lightened up a little bit. Okay, move your arm around this, see if it works. Feels a lot better. A whole lot better. Okay, good enough. Well, thank you so much. Appreciate it.